second I gave to debate was a mistake. Not thinking long and hard was a regret I hold and take. I don't hate the person that lies beneath this tainted flesh. I hate the cloud of desperate despair lingering over me, waiting for a change of heart that isn't even there. The story of a young girl who gave in to the sun's dark side ended with the light coming from the moon's brightest side. The moon yelled for me to change my ways and see how things would furnish. The highway I was taking would have only ended in death. And this girl who stands before you, making an effort to live, might not be breathing in this crisp air. You soak up like purified water. I cannot speak for all of you, but most, the body you hold so high, the one that travelizes the grief, giving a false hope, perched above the clouds, make, makes me feel as if you know nothing about pain. How could I live, have lived through a lifetime of sheltered existence, so cold not even death would quench my thirst, as you sat there drinking tea by the pool, reading a magazine. The moment I let the words fro flow from the pages of which they were born on was when I saw what was considered true beauty. That moment was withheld from my frail concept for three more years, leaving me in the dense reality of the bitter truth. What is known to eat you up until you can hardly breathe, what stops your heart from screaming high above the rooftops to the world beneath a crow's wings, where the, where the mountains are thorns rising up, stabbing the pink and orange mural we call a sunset. Fear is what stops your heart from beating, but makes your heart play a sweet symphony. Woo! The fact is when you overcome fear, the life rushes through your veins, threatening to burst. How do I know? It happened to me, making me spout out gray hairs as if they were a fountain, shooting out from the ground with such a force nobody would dare try to control. Fear rips and sows you until you cannot take it anymore. Woo! But by then, you are just holes. Strong holes, though, woven together, stronger than air and time put together. Fear is the, be the beginning to the end. Don't think of it as ugly, think of it as beauty. Without fear, I would not be here today. It has made me a strong, but thoughtful person, now questioning everything. For that, I think, but also hate fear for the gift it bestowed upon me with no intention of taking back. Why I was chosen is beyond me. I never asked for an objective eye on all this unnecessary roses and daisies being put on display that I once raised in the field of dreams, believing it meant something. You don't need to sugarcoat life, that's what ice cream is for. <laughs> Be true to yourself and don't let anyone bring you down. For I fear the soft, tempting whispers of the wind will pull your soul in. Woo!